What's going on? It's Wes with Wes Almeida Restorations. I'm back with another video. I got a nice pair of orange Gatorade orange peel. Looking good. Not right now, but they will. Come back and I'm going to show you how, what I'm going to get done. All right. So again, like I said, we have a nice pair of Jordan 1 Gatorade Orange Peel. They are not looking as good as they should, and I'm going to make them back to where they need to be. So we're, first of all, we're going to start off with, we're going to take out our laces and our insoles. We're going to get these nice and clean again. So let's get started. One lace out. I'm going to put it in a different bowl because these shoes are pretty dirty. I'm going to put the laces in one and pre-treat it while I'm doing the, uh, washing the outside. And you can see the difference there that is that is on there i'm hoping i'm able to get some of that off oh wow hope i'm getting able to get all of it off but one lace out all right lace number two is out going in the water all right just to show you again this is not a filter that i'm using at all nice and orange there that's that's the tongue all right so these are these are not in good shape again nice and orange on that side but this side is not so good that is not a filter so let's get started got the insoles too all right got them both out they don't look that good but we'll make them back to hopefully that light green that they're supposed to be i'm only going to record video of me doing the one shoe the other one's going to get done as well because I'm hopefully I'm going to have these back to him. We have to make sure they're going to be completely dry. So uh, probably two days. So again, we're going to do the wash clean inside and out. And then we'll put them in the washing machine. Don't know if we could do anything with this on the bottom. I don't know if we will need an ice box session or not. But we will see if some of that comes off and it looks a lot better. But for now, we're going to start with our soft bristle brush. And our solution, we're going to take it to the outside of the shoes and to the insoles. All right, let's get started. You know what, I'm going to take this tag off too. All right, so the soft bristle brush part is done with this. It is definitely not coming out as good as I want it to, but we're gonna go to the midsole. Hopefully a lot of this will be able to come out in the washing machine. But we're gonna go to the midsole for now. I'm not sure what's all over this thing, but it's, this is probably my biggest challenge here, so. Going to the stiff to the bottom of the soles, the outsoles. We're back from the laundry room and this is what we have for the shoes. Just took the shoe trees out. Right now they're still being, trying to form the toe area again, get that back in shape. But it doesn't look bad at all. The shoe bottoms came out real nice. Got them nice and clear almost. All right, so again, we're just gonna try to reshape these shoes. So, Check out the uh, insoles. See if we need to take off any of the lint anywhere from inside or on the outside. Like there's a couple of straggler pieces here and there. So we're going to take them off. I don't think we do an ice box session for these, but they look pretty good. <laughs> look at that. I did real good on that. 
whatever. We're going to start doing some touch-ups here now. All right, well that's gonna do it for this pair of shoes. There's another pair coming up, but we have these looking pretty good. Most of the markings are off. It's not quite as good of a bright color as in some places that I would like for it to have, but I think that comes from wearing over time. Also, I had to do a lot of scrubbing to get some of that soot from the fire out. Some places just didn't come out as good as I wanted to. It probably needs another retouch on the paint job just about everywhere. If you want it to be, you know, a, a consistent color, but they came out real good. The inside, outside, completely clean, and so they look pretty good. This pair of shoes is done. They're looking good again, though. All right, so if you like this video, make sure you give me that thumbs up button, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell so you get all the videos when they come out. As always, I appreciate your support. Peace.